AKA uh, Uji Koshi's favorite pitcher. <laughs> Uji Koshi's pinned tweet. Mm hmm. Oh, who this? Classmate? Who the fuck? Who the fuck? So much who the fuck. Man, this sucks. I heard he talked my jaw uh -huh. off yesterday. Howdy face. That was with the local detective, right? I haven't heard anything yet. Big sis, perhaps you should help them. Big sis? Okay. Yeah, she, I guess... I guess she's just tall for her age. Big sis? Ah, that's just what I call Mizuki. Ah, and you're... My name is Kizuna. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hi. I'm from the Metropolitan Police Department. Ryuki, right? What's up, Oda? You up, no, Oda? Go away. Show last night. Go so away. Okay, first thing. No, first. thank you! Uh... Just a customer, I guess? Just want to get that calendar. Out of uh, beer poster. Wait, Moon. Said check the calendar. We're gonna check the calendar. A lot of dates on that calendar. <laughs> That's how calendars work, Tama. Why not go on a date yeah. with me? Gross. No thanks. I'll go on a what? date with you. <laughs> Ryuki, get the guy here. I'll give her my love die. Tama, what's up? <laughs> There's a calendar on the wall. And nothing specific you know, it, about the calendar. It's probably up to date now that Oda Yeah, I, I just store. wanted to see it, like I was a little worried that it would just, that he would have left it and I was like, no, Oda. Which one do we want to look at? Uh I think all the autographs are gonna Are all the autographs separate or are they all the same? They're yeah. all separate. Um click on middle top. This one? Yeah. With the bear on it? Yeah. I mean, we know that's Monokuma. Look it. Yeah, we, we gotta do it for the dang rope people that came in. There are autographs from famous people on display. Aww. Aww. Yeah, so they are all one asset. Yeah. Okay. Even though it's pinging as a different asset. Yeah, it's well, just because it's got like gas. No. Hmm. Oh, <laughs> no. Really weird. No. I'll sell you that poster for a thousand yen. No, thank you. <laughs> wow. Who do you think he is, it's Dase? So, it's so tight. There, there mm. was another mm. thing to say mm. on the poster. Mm. Hold up. Wait a second. No. Done. <laughs> Why did you say it like that? Uh. There we go. Mm. There's a beer poster on the wall. <laughs> Disposable chopsticks. Mr. Ryuki, there's a video of Tessa playing Mulku. Want to watch? Maybe later. What's wrong with his face? I don't know. Look stoned. It's a CRT television. That's a bookshelf. <laughs> okay, so ah, yes. Uh. What are you doing? Haven't you heard? If you meow at a lucky cat statue, happiness will come your way. I see. <laughs> it's a lucky cat statue. My lucky cat is beeping at me. That's a window. Oh. Uh, there are strips of paper with the menu ran on them on the wall. I was going to say the stickers. Can't click on the stickers. Ah. I guess click on the stool. It's not about Ota, so we don't need to know. It's a stool. A chair without a back rest. Kizzy, if you wanted to change the light bulbs or something, you can stack the cases there and stand on top of them. No, thank you. I have absolutely no desire to do so. Wow. Oh, damn. Damn. I love her. I want Izzy. Oda to drop dead. A table. 
Salt, pepper, spices, and... It says Ota's black sauce. No. 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 <clears throat> There's a mysterious condiment on the table. He's cooking food in the kitchen. It's a counter. Mizuki is sitting in front of me. Uh, Kizuna Chieda. 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 I was close. Yeah, uh, I, for it, it just you have to like do that sa extra sound. Right. There's a swinging door installed here. There's a family photo on display. Uh, first things first, let's talk to the mysterious man in the corner. Floor cushion. Oh, There's a little table at... Oh, excuse me. <laughs> your burps are okay, now your turn. At the what? Leaf, it's your turn. Uh, <laughs> My turn it, for what? Burping. Burp. No thanks. Because we both burped. There's a little table at the Zashiki seat. So you want to talk to the man first? Mm -hmm. Uh, we already looked at him. I know. That's why I'm waiting Ex for you to pick. Excuse me. Maybe you shouldn't talk to that guy. He seems pretty drunk. He's drinking non-alcoholic beer. <laughs> jerk. I was not aware you could get drunk from non-alcoholic beverages. How are you? It's all right now, because I am here! How are you, young boy? Why does <laughs> help? Oh. Yuki really is something. <laughs> yes, he's oh, not no, doing he's too good. good. Your name? Pardon me, but may I ask your name? There's no response. He seems to be depressed. Me too, buddy. Uh... Okay. <laughs> All right. So now, who do we talk to? Let's talk to the new person. Uh, are you a student at Shikiba? Sakiba. Sakiba High. I am indeed. How did you know? Your uniform. Don't tell me you're a uniform buff for Yuki. Oda, I'm going oh. to punch you. I'm literally going to slam your head on the counter. Like, I didn't take you yeah. for a pervert. Ready for Oda to die, ready for <sighs> Oda to die okay? Because he is good friends with Iris and Mame, too. Oh, you don't know about Mame, do you? Amame doys her full name. She attends Sekiba High like Kizzy and Iris. Iris and Mame belong mm. to the same dance club as I. It was through them that I was introduced to Big Sis. Why do you call Mizuki that? Hmm. This is a bit difficult to explain. I just sensed a certain elegance to Mizuki that was characteristic of an older sister. It... <laughs> is that a compliment? Tama. How old is Kizuna? 18, same as Iris. They're in their third year, so they're graduating soon. Weird. In other words, Mizuki is a whole six years younger than Kizuna. Maybe. Mm. You like dancing, Maybe. huh? Yes, I most certainly do. You like jazz? However, I knew you were gonna do that. I'm not very good at it. <laughs> That's not true. You've even won a dancing competition before. 
That was nothing more than a fluke. Iris is a far better dancer. I mean, I'll be the judge of dancer, right? Hey, how about you go and sit in a river right now? Well, the closest river is only like a foot high, so... Yeah, well, you need to cool off, clearly. It's too is... hot outside. Yeah, uh-huh. Uh about the incident last night. I was watching that quiz show live as well. Then, goodness, I couldn't believe it. That corpse suddenly appeared on the screen. I couldn't sleep last night from the shock of it all. I was worried about Big Sis and Iris as well. Yeah, you called me a bunch, I remember. You witnessed the corpse with your own eyes, did you not? Are you certain you're... okay? I'm totally fine. Your mental fortitude is admirable. I mean, they've seen a body before. I was a mm -hmm. the first spot. I've been through a lot is all. Who next? Ota. To make Boon suffer. Uh, so this gal is voiced uh, by a VTuber, actually. Oh, okay. A, a, VTu a VTuber named uh, Monarch. Uh, her hmm. actual name is Ama uh, uh, Amelie, which is, is a combination of her actual name, Amanda Lee. Ah, gotcha. Hmm. She, she has uh, done a bunch of dubbing. Uh, Ota, your name. Are you Mr. Ota Matsushita? Oh, you heard of me? Did you talk to Date or something? Yeah, something like that. He's linked to the new Cyclops serial killings. That's how I know his name and age. Ota is 24. One year older than you, Ryuki. Yeah, that's why I'm being polite. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm being polite and not suplexing him to death right here in the store. No, sorry. Exactly. Uh, does someone else work here? Nah. Ota handles the cooking, serving, and accounting all by himself. Wow. Wow. Does he clean? <laughs> That's right. Tama, are there any legal issues with this? Really? Mm. You're gonna go after him, Ryuki? What the fuck? Yeah, he's Man, gross. He's gross and fucking weird. <laughs> not at all. His mother, Mayumi Matsushita, holds the proper certification for food hygiene. Mr. Matsushita, can I ask where your mother is? Probably in the living room back there. I guess she's sitting oh, at the God. Kotatsu watching TV or something. Thank fuck! Matsushita Diner was closed for a long time. It recently reopened. They get decent customer traffic and make pretty good amount of money. Good. Excellent. Good. You take care of your fucking mom, dude. You better. Uh... <laughs> Do you have a girlfriend? <laughs> Do you have a girlfriend? Bet you don't have a girlfriend. Of course I have one. Uh huh. What's her name? Right? Tessa. The girl named Iris. No, Saga. no, 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 no. Stop no. it. Oh, Tessa, yeah, do lie. you want me to rip your tongue out? <laughs> <laughs> Get him. Oh, well, as long as we're on the subject. Are you going out with anyone, Kizzy? Oh, my... Oda, can you drop dead? Such Kizzy's relations with, with gentlemen are completely foreign to me. Are you into like said, baby face guys that know how to cook? Mm. Ugh. No shame. Oh, my type is so stereotypical that I am embarrassed to admit it. Someone like Prince Girls Charming. With huge tits. A prince? Of course. I yearn to be a princess. <laughs> and you're 18? Listen, I hope my Prince Charming she's will still appear very young. me with a glass slipper someday. Mm. 
That's my dream. Yeah, Mizuki's yeah, older just... than her. <laughs> and yet you're just stuck with a rat behind the counter serving your food. Mm-hmm. Glass slipper? What well, he speaks. Ota? Who is that? Well, he's a customer. He comes by a lot. What's his name? Um, well, he doesn't know it, case, obviously. I have a great affinity for shoes. Hmm. <laughs> I yearn to be a princess. Marry Mizuki. She fi she'll fit the bill. She'll at least be able to pick you up without any effort. Literally, you'll feel like two grapes to her. Yep. Mm -hmm. My admiration of Princess Cinderella partially comes from that, I'm sure. Glass slippers. Isn't that so magical? How lovely it would be to dance in them. Ow. Wouldn't it be hard to yeah. dance in glass slippers? <laughs> that is true. About the incident last night. Man, that was crazy. I said it before, but I was watching that stream live. I heard Tessa mm -hmm. and Mizuki were going to be on that show, right? Then that mm -hmm. body appeared mm -hmm. out of nowhere. Man, I couldn't believe what I saw. Speaking of crazy, that ViewCube video. Of course you went and watched it. You saw it. I mean, well, yeah. what's wrong? You know. No, not the whole thing. Too scary. I saw the one before, though. <laughs> the one before? The one before? Hmm? You don't know? I think it was about half a year ago. A video similar to that one went viral. Everyone was talking about it online. Ah, I know of that one as well. The mysterious video known as Bats 490, correct? Hold up. Nope, I'm 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 doing it. <laughs> Fuck off. The two tin hatters in the room. <laughs> Listen, I have seen that video before, and I don't know why. Bats 490 though only comes up as a track from the soundtrack. <laughs> yep, there was some ah. kind of code hidden in it too. According to the rumors, whoever deciphers it will learn the secret of the world. Wait a secret minute. Secret of the world. Did a grade schooler come up with that or something? Wait a minute. So, Spike Chunsoft launches real-time mystery, Hidden Bats. Uh, <laughs> newly launched online mystery is likely tied to the, the game upcoming released. The website features a video called Bats 489 and a similar video titled Bats 490, which featured in the story trailer for the game. Hmm. <laughs> so it's Honks. tied to the ARG. Yeah, honks with distress. Hmm. Okay. Anyway. You're a grade schooler yourself, by the way. <clears throat> uh, about bats 490. Maybe we can actually see the, the video, video here. starts with a bunch of bats flying around. Yes, that's where the bats part comes from. I don't say. I don't know what the 490 means, though. Were you able to decode it? No way. I had no idea what it meant. Well, it's not it like solving it would have been a big deal. I'll bet that secret of the world stuff is bogus anyway. Don't ruin the fantasy, Mizuki. I'm just telling it like it is. It's just an ARG. It's a game for kids. ARG means alternate reality game. The game master releases mysterious information to the public via the internet, leaflets, posters, stuff like that. Players decode the information to discover a Look. location or objective that moves the game forward. Yes, Rogue? Or my mic fell. Hmm. <clears throat> Simply put, an ARG is a fusion of games and real life. 
Mm. Goal of an ARG varies. If someone beats it, they may get a prize, but most times it's just a prank. Oftentimes the main objective is simply to solve the mystery. Sometimes they're even used as a marketing tool. ARG are progressed by an unidentified, undefined number of players working together, mainly online. Due to this, it has a high potential to spread fast. That makes it very helpful when marketing content. Speaking of the the ARG, uh, Uchikoshi, uh, when I was looking through his tweets, apparently they fucked up one of their calculations for like a number that was needed for the decoder. So he was apologizing for that because and and was releasing the the actual number. Uh. Mm. I never did the the ARG for the marketing for this. I didn't have the time. It's Neither did going. I. I'm not smart enough. It's still going? Yeah, as far as I understood it, it was still going. I mean, I should follow it. Um, I mean, you <clears> are following it. I saw that you were following one of the main accounts for it. Yeah, but, I mean... Yeah, I get you. Yeah. Shouldn't you be in school? Today is February 11th, National Foundation Day. Oh yeah, it is. So, why are you here? Why else? To eat some of Ota's cooking. I brought my friend Kizzy oh, with nice. me. And I appreciate your business. About the only business you'll ever get, boy. Uh, <laughs> Dabs. I saw Mr. Date earlier. Huh. And... I mean, Mr. Date is like your foster father, so I thought I'd let you know just in case. Foster father? I'm the one taking care of him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm paying the rent and utility bills too. Damn. What? Wait. Because she's rich. Right. Oh, oh I know of Mr. She... Date as well. Oh. He is quite close with Iris. Oh, Mary. So I have Did the honor of being on friendly terms with him as well. Mm. The honor. Great. Any clues? Sorry, but I don't know anything. I just went on the show like mm. Iris asked. And then a body showed up out of nowhere. I've heard about Jin Furue, but it's not like I knew him personally. Sorry, I can't really help. Mary Why just chewed on my finger. On she, she what? She just chewed on my finger like it was like a tree. I mean, <laughs> om, om nom nom human flesh. Leaf, am I right? I think she's yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Why were you on the show last night? Iris had an offer to appear on the show. So she was asked okay. to bring another talent from Lemnus Gate, but no one could make it, so I decided to go instead. As the president of Lemnus Gate, I couldn't just turn it down. Oh yeah, she's... She would have inherited that, huh? Wait, mm -hmm. isn't, isn't there some thing where she has to be like 18? Or something? Well, we'll see if probably in the, the dialogue. President? Aren't you 12? <laughs> it's a long story. I ended up taking over the company after Daddy. No, I would like to know more about that. Hey, Kizzy, I want to see yeah. you dance. Where did this come from? Dance, 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 too. dance. Don't you want to see too, Ryuki? Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Oh, I've got to see this. Then I'll play some music. Just a sec. Wait, um, I have not agreed to anything yet. <laughs> peer pressure, peer pressure, peer pressure. Mm -hmm.
Okay. Oh, that, creepy, that, that guy with the creepy face, though. No. All I can think I about is how her backpack. Hey, you're Kizuna, aren't you? Oh, no. Uh, what was that? Backpack's man? like a. Uh, all I can think about is her backpack's a realistic depiction of a heart. <clears throat> yeah! Yeah. Weird. <laughs> mm -hmm. He's doing heart work. So I, I will say my only problem with that song, she's she's a better singer than Iris, but she's just her voice is weak. Because she's not used to actually singing and projecting. Yeah. She's got stage fright. Yeah. Well, I don't know about the character, but I know that like as far as the, the singer goes, like You yeah. should probably look her stuff up. I'm sure it's I'm sure it's better that way. Yeah. I'm sure it was coached that way for the thing. Maybe. Uh, does this man's tattoo say danger tattoo? I do not know. I know it says danger something. Danger zone, I think. Oh, okay. Maybe just dangerous. Oh. No, there's definitely a Z I, I there. Think, I think it's danger zone, yeah. Oh. I heard you introducing yourself earlier. My name's Leon. Leon Twining. And I'm 22 years old. You don't look 22. Bitch, you're 22 and you look like that? Damn. I mean, Life's been hard. I mean... Hey, you guys are being rude. <laughs> he looks extremely tired! And he's Is at it, least I mean, gotten into one fight. <laughs> he's got some city miles on that. <laughs> he's gotten into at least one fight because his nose is broken. It doesn't have to be a fight to break your nose. You could hit a fucking tree branch. <laughs> What if he's super klutzy? What if he's just a womanizer and his nose is broken because a woman punched him? He doesn't look like... I think you're projecting a little. Because you're Date. <laughs> no. <laughs> I've never had a woman punch me before. Also, that reminds me. Uh, Ryuki... Well, I didn't mean that you actually. It was a joke about <laughs> Date being a fucking nerd. But yeah. no, I was gonna say, man, Date really is Ryuki's fail wife, huh? Mm. Like... Yeah. He really is. P CPCU agrees. More like life beat the shit out of him. Yeah. yeah. He's had a hard life. Yeah. Feel bad for him. My father's American and my mother's Japanese. Oh, that explains a lot. Okay. Mm. That's why he's oh designed my. that way because he's cause, cause American and they tend to yeah, stereotype. They tend to stereotype Americans, so. Yeah. I mean, we stereotype Japanese, so... Yep. <laughs> Abs. So, Kizuna. I want you to marry me. Sir? What the fuck? <laughs> Look at the sparkly. <laughs> I think you should take a picture of the sparklies. Marco <laughs> says, be gone! We tend to stereotype, period. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Stereo. Stereotype. Stereo. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Oda. <laughs> I will say Oda does have some of the best faces, though. Oh, yeah, because he's, he's allowed to emote, like, beyond... Uh. Beyond normal. Yeah. 
Because he's an anime character and not a pseudo-realistic anime character. Huh? Oh, yeah. Man. Um... Ooh. Sir, you are on the ground. <laughs> She's in a... Chieda. <laughs> he looks completely out of it. Oh, why are you? Are you okay? No, I'm not okay. My heart feels like nope, a jackhammer. Okay. Like it's gonna burst out of my chest any second. <laughs> well then, that's, what? that's certainly a thing to say to people. What? What? Why are you here? Actually, I got fired yesterday. So what nope. did she got to marry you then? Like, okay, <laughs> you know. Don't um okay let's hear oh, Am anything after Am I woke Lee. up this morning. Oh. Amelie was apparently the stepsisters in Ruby. Hmm. Huh. I came here so I could drink my problems away. But With you no were drinking non-alcoholic beer. I can still get drunk off of them, okay? <laughs> okay. I mean, Weaver was talking about like um Psychosomatic yeah, drunkenness. Psychosomatic. What job yeah. did you get fired from? I was a you bank went to the brewery. clerk. What? I doubt. What were you really? I don't like talking about it, but I was a janitor. Oh, honey. I think that is a noble uh. job. You're so right! <clears throat> <laughs> my job Sparkle Boy! I have zero motivation to do anything now. See, I look at him and I just, I feel pity is what I feel. <laughs> yeah, this, this, this guy is absolutely husband material. I don't know what the fuck you guys are so, about. So, life didn't beat the shit out of him. He was cleaning up the shit and then got fired. Hard work just really? seems so pointless. I dislike people who don't work hard. <laughs> oh, All right. Oh. I'm hitting up the employment office tomorrow. <laughs> Damn, she's a manipulator. This guy has a rather one-track mind. Mm -hmm. He doesn't seem all that bad, though. He's just earnest. I mean, she's at least using her power for good, but at the same time, like... Yeah, <laughs> LMAO. Yeah. <laughs> Still... Fucking. Anyway. No, no, you did hear correctly. Oh, yeah, yeah the. In the Ruby. Office, like RWBY, right? Is what you were talking about? Yeah. The stepsisters yeah. for Cinder's story? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't, I, I didn't want to, like, point that hard on it in case somebody was, like, not there yet, but yeah, from Cinder's story. Well, if people don't know that Cinder is supposed to be a Cinderella thing, then I'm sorry. You missed literally every every key down to mm. her name. I mean, she's such a horrible bitch. I know, right? <laughs> like, yeah, you could totally have that go over your head if you weren't really into her. <laughs> I'm still You're... confused about what goes on oh. with uh, with Neapolitan. I don't know what's up with her. Revenge. Um, you're She's joking. ice cream rather than a fictional character. <laughs> you're joking about the marriage thing, right? Of course this isn't a joke. Izuna's dance purified my heart. Yeah. There was so yeah. much darkness building inside me, but she cleared it all away. It felt like I went straight to heaven. Mm. I've always wanted to be a pilot since I was little. It was my dream to fly through the sky. Kizuna made that dream. Is come that why you have dangerous one on your fate fucking chest? Seeing her dance, it was like my soul pierced the heavens and flew into the stars. So uh -huh. I've decided. I'm gonna marry her. Well, she doesn't want to marry you. Won't you marry me, Kizuna? Sweetie. No. No, thank you. Oh. 
And she just killed a man. That's fine. Oda, oh, stop it with that face. <laughs> Oda's like, ah, so that's what it's like from this side. Mm-hmm. I'll pretend I didn't hear that. Oh, no. No, thank you. Oh, no. <laughs> I'll pretend I didn't hear that either. <laughs> no, thank you. No, thank you. Anyway, <laughs> I won't give up. You'll come around eventually, oh. Kizuna. Oh, no. My mother I'm a police officer. If at first you don't succeed, try and fail again! I think you mean try, try again. Uh. So no. I'm a police officer. We haven't obtained much useful information. There's no point in staying here for too long. Yeah, let's go somewhere else. He looks completely out of it. I know, Kevin. <clears throat> I know you're. It, it's really saying, get the fuck out. Yep. Yeah. No opinions from the rest of the peanut gallery. All right. Iris or Moma. <laughs>